so I need needed to take off all of the I don't know what these are called uh, harnesses or shafts I'm not sure what their actual name is uh, but I've taken off seven of them and they are made up of these plastic end pieces and um, two of these metal poles um, found some quite interesting things so Two of the um, toggles are, are basically attached to the shafts using some shoelaces, which is interesting. And one of these, um, the it's got a sort of little circle on the top that you put the um, well the cord through before you you tie a knot in it, uh, and that's broken off one of them. So the other person's very cleverly used this what looks like well it's probably a piece of wire quite thick wire looks a little bit like a paper clip and they've wrapped it around and attached it to the cord so it cleverly holds up um the end of that harness so that's pretty ingenious i might end up having to use that if i can't replace it um but i basically took a little bit of fiddling about to work out how to actually get it off and there's there's lots of grooves down this side um, and the way of taking these in and out, I've worked out on this loom at least, is there's two grooves down this side and there's two bits that stick into it on both sides. You can't take it out that side, but if you slide this uh, up so it lines up with the grooves, then you can take it out forwards or backwards. So take it out forwards and then take the ends off. I'll just let that hang for a minute and actually I'll leave the ends on this side uh, and then I've just been hooking over um, to get these heddles off and I've just been putting them on this stick for now and then tying them um, afterwards so I'll take the rest of them off and um, and then undoing these on the side. And then you'll find that actually the toggle just comes out once I've undone it from this side, which I can do as well. I'll just take the rest of these off. on here and then I've been tying them um, into little bunches so I've got all these little bunches I probably should have put them through um, so they're all in the same order but hopefully it won't matter I can just thread them all on I don't think it matters particularly which way around they go on as long as they all go back on so I've got a load of bunches of those um, and then what I need to do is um, work out how I'm going to clean these um, and give all the plastic a wipe um, and yeah I can take that toggle out now and I've been labelling the toggle so I know roughly what length to make the cord afterwards but I think they maybe were sitting a little bit too low so I might try them a little bit higher but I might need to um, see how high the other ones were um, so yeah so that's the next step give it a clean um, I think I'm going to need to order some new replacement well my, I've asked how much these cost I expect they're going to be extortionately expensive so I might just go back to using the little piece of metal um, give these a clean and I think I need some more um, sticks for apparently you're supposed to have one that attaches to here um, that you attach your warp to um, and then I think one at the other side so I need to work out if I've got enough or I might need to get some more um, and have a look at warping